simulating a flood. And the MQTT receiver picks up on the message published from the leak detector. I'm not sure if you can see it or not, but it says leak in basement. And to cancel the alarm, once you've seen it, or if it's false, just press the button for a moment. That's why it's called a momentary button. And that is how it goes. Now, the detector is still in the water, still detecting a leak. We'll remove it. Leak has been plugged. Cancel out the alarm again. And since there's no more water detected on that sensor, the alarm does not go off any longer, and we're clear. Imagine that in your house. That's a great idea. And I'm going to build this and put it in mine. So I would recommend keeping from the previous project the piezo attached to the ESP01 locally near where you're parking this leak sensor and then in addition have this one as well with the audible someplace closer to where you normally are so that's our new leak detector using MQTT over Wi-Fi instead of just a basic no Wi-Fi local alarm both versions are great you can use the first version and the MQTT text notifier box and slam them together into this new project and I hope this helps someone it's been a lot of fun one more version might be coming around the corner I'd like to try and get this all hooked up with smart things and when I get that complete I will put together another video and instructable for you guys to see hope everything's going great your way and have a great day bye now